All right, so for those of you not familiar with Spanish coins, here's a quick uh, lesson, if you want to call it that. This is a Carolus III, 1784, obviously, 8 real. If you flip the coin over, you'll see the two pillars, the pillars of Hercules, the shield, and the crown. If you look to the left pillar, you see where it says 8R, that means it's an 8 real. If it was a 4 real, it would be 4R and 2 real, 2R, and so and so and so and so and on and on. Just before the denomination, you'll see that little symbol. On this particular one, it's this wacky P. That lets you know that it's a Potassi Mint. And this particular coin is actually more rare than some of the other Mexico Mints ones. I'm going to show you the Mexico Mint one in a second. Hang on. Okay, so another 8 real. This one is a 1778 Carolus III again, 8 real. Flip it over, like I showed you on the last one. You'll see the two pillars, pillars of Hercules, the shield, and the crown. Look to the left of the pillar, and you'll see the 8R. If you notice, it's a different, it's different lettering here, FF. And if you look just before the 8, you'll see the M with the circle over it. That means it's a Mexico mint which is a little more common than the Potassi. Now, if you look at the two of these together, it might be difficult for you to tell, but the Potassi is noticeably larger than the Mexico Mint, and actually more rare. This one is more rare, and a good find. I only have a couple of these Potassis. I've got a lot of these, but these are classic. And there is different mint marks. Um, there's Potassi, there's Mexico, there's Lima. There's several different uh, mint marks, so quick lesson. Later.